Hello everybody, this is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo. Today we're going to be making some earrings with the Jesse James Bead Ambassador Kit I received November 2021. Yesterday was a very rainy day. We had planned on taking family pictures since we were all out on our property in Tennessee. Unfortunately, that didn't happen. Before the rain, the changing fall leaves were absolutely gorgeous. But after the rain came, the leaves were pretty much all gone, and the weather turned very cold. Today it's 36, but I decided to take a stroll through the woods and take some pictures of the earrings I made last night. I'm so happy I brought a piece of the cedar we cut last spring. I can still remember the aroma and the popping of the freshly cut wood. It makes a great backdrop for my jewelry. Well, without further ado, let me show you how I made some earrings using these gorgeous beads. I'll be using selections from the Jesse James Bead Holiday Bead Mix in Christmas Sage. And while I'm creating, I want you all to think about what I can do with this gorgeous chain. It is the enamel chain in Sage, and I'm just at a loss of what to do. One other thing, I would like to apologize for the lighting. It is horrific, but with the rain and it being the evening, and there's nearly not a whole lot of good lighting in my in-law's house, I just had to deal with it. So for this project, I'm going to use some seed beads, ear wires, head pins. I need wire cutters, round nose pliers, flat nose pliers. The first thing I'm going to do is open this up and pour everything in a bowl so I can dig around and find exactly what I want to use. So for this first pair of earrings, we're going to use these snowflakes. The fabric beads, a couple of gold colored e beads, some tiny, tiny little silver tone seed beads, head pin, and ear wire. Just finishing them off here. And we're gonna make one other pair of earrings. So stay tuned. 
But here are these fun snowflakes that can be worn during Christmas or after Christmas. By the way, you may hear some joyful cheering of my grandchildren in the background. These next earrings, I'm going to use those little glass bead caps and then those tall bead caps and those little crystals and the pearlescent bead, green bead, another crystal. And I'm going to use some tiny little silver tone seed beads, the gold tone, or I guess they're gold bead, they're glass e beads, and a head pin and ear wire. Finishing these up and actually they look like little fairies or angels, probably more like angels. But I'm very pleased with them. I love the way they turned out. Let me know what you think about my earrings. Which one is your favorite? I actually like the angel ones the best, I believe. One thing about either one of these pair of earrings, you could wear them, you know, all through the winter and fall. They're not just Christmassy. If you're interested in this collection of beads, it is actually from the Jesse Jane Bead Holiday Bead Mix in Christmas Sage. I'll leave a link down below so you can go check that out. I'm grateful that today turned out really nice so I could go out and take pictures of these really pretty earrings. It was a little chilly, but it was still a nice day. So anyway, that's my video for today. I hope you all have a fantastically wonderful day. This is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo signing out for now. Bye-bye.